What's going on everybody? So good morning. I wanted to do a quick video. Uh, something I get asked quite a bit is how do I change the speed or how do I change the speed limits on my truck? Now there's actually one way to do it. You do need the software. You are going to need to go in and make some changes. These are parameter changes. So you're going to see here on the parameters, you're going to go to parameters. It's going to load up. Now, one thing I am going to say, just a disclosure guys, you are responsible for your speed. Okay. Sometimes these trucks are governed at lower speeds. In this case, 77 is the limit, and that's going to be at the pedal. You're also going to have a cruise control speed, which is going to be here in this case at 70. So the customer actually wants to leave the pedal the way it is, but wants to increase the cruise control. So in this case, I think he wants it to match what the pedal is saying. So again, those are two different things that you're going to need to do. Again, guys, just keep in mind, I'm going to just, again, disclosure, you're responsible for your speed. So if you want to increase it to, let's say, 80 or 85 or 78 or whatever the case is, again, every state's a little different. You're responsible for that, but this is how you do it. So if you go to your speed, let's say you want to go here to 77, okay? Sometimes I know when you get out of the state of California, the limits change. Uh, so in this case, I think he wants it at 78. And the same thing goes for cruise control. So he wants to set that at 78. So once you do that, there really is nothing else you need to do. On some of the newer trucks, it's a different change or parameter that you have to do in addition to the ones I just showed you. And what you're gonna to wanna to do is go down here to send. It's gonna let you know, hey, these are the changes you're gonna do. Click on okay. If there's no password, this is exactly what will happen. It will automatically save that parameter and you're all done. Okay, it just takes a few seconds. It doesn't take very long. I know when you go to the dealership, they charge you whatever they charge you. Again, it's a dealership. So as of now, let me go back and verify that the changes were done. Check that out. We are at 78 miles per hour. See, 78. I'm gonna go back to the cruise control just to verify. Oops, sorry, wrong one. Cruise control, and that is also set at 78 miles per hour. So that's it, that's all you need to do. And again, guys, be safe when you're doing these changes. You know, I know some guys, I've had the request in the past where they say, hey, I wanna go up to 100 or hell no, again think you know it's not really just about getting there that fast it's about getting there safely so keep this in mind and again that's it that's really the whole point of the video so you can see just how easy it is when you make those changes and you go in and remove the restrictions so guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up it's just a quick little video uh, again easy peasy you guys can do this if you have the software that's it if it's password protected different story uh, in this case no password guys thank you for watching have a great day